Stars are tracing the sky like city windows I watch you reflect in your eyes Slow dance on the news Welcome to the story of Keegan and Isaiah. You and me on top of the world And I'm feeling Stand up here and tell you the exact moment, the exact time that I knew that you were the one. Keegan, from the bottom of my heart, you are truly the best thing that has ever happened to me. You are my biggest cheerleader, support system, and best friend. Marriage is God's plan, His creation, and His purpose is good. It's sacred and it's eternally important. Their desire is to have a marriage that is lifelong, marked by commitment and devotion. Something in you feels like myself. So what we came to learn about this guy over the last three years is probably what most of you have known for even longer than we have, and that this guy is the genuine, real deal. He's one of the good ones. Keegan loves people, and he's passionate about helping people make their lives better. I tell her all the time, smile more. She lights up the room. She's fiercely loyal, loves completely. Isaiah has been a friend, especially to Cindy, at just the right moment. Some might say, perhaps you've been made for such a time as this, like the little lady Esther out of the Bible. You have the biggest heart for everything and everyone around you. You showed me what unconditional love is like, emotionally and physically. You make loving you so easy. Isaiah, I promise to love you, to love you as you were, and to love you as who you are to become. I promise to take you as mine, to profess my love to, to provide for, and to protect. Slow dance on the New York City rise. You and me. He's a dedicated guy with a heart for service. Service to his country, service to his clients, and service to his friends and family. And that's why I thank the big man upstairs for you, and why it's an honor and a privilege to call you my friend. You've been an ally and a confidant, and especially for Sydney, a rock that she's been able to crash against during the most difficult time of our lives. Both of you mean the world to us. I've never known before. I feel so safe with you. I feel accepted for everything that I was and everything that I am. I promise to entrust you with all my strengths and all my faults. If we want to feel loved, then we have to begin by knowing that we are truly loved. Love embraced becomes love extended. The love is invisible, it's not imperceptible. You're the one I've waited all my life for. You're the True love willingly commits to stay even when life gets really, really complicated. True love stays even when everybody else walks out. Love sends, love sacrifices, and love stays. So if we want to be a source of love, we have to be connected to the source of love. And if we want to be a source of life, we have to be in relationship with the giver of life. I love you.
you right there. I love us. And I love that I get to spend the rest of my life with my happy kids. Till our final breath, my love is I promise to be the best wife and the best mother to our future children. And I promise I will always choose you at the beginning of each day and everything in between. You are my heart, my home, and my happy place. I love you. Darkness. We're here today to bear witness to God's plan and purpose for Keegan and Isaiah and their marriage and their lives together. Two lives will become one right before our very eyes as Keegan and Isaiah enter into a marriage covenant with the creator of the universe. I now pronounce that you are husband and wife. Kiss your bride. Or we can hope and wish for as a father on your daughter they should pick the right man to spend the rest of their life. That leads me to Keegan. My stake buddy, right? My son now, I should say that. happy that you know you met Isaiah Isaiah you are wonderful you guys are perfect together um, thank you so much for having me as part of the family it's, it's an honor and uh, you know many happy years to you how proud I am of the person you've become you and I have always had each other for everything including inside jokes that tear my stomach up. You've had your fair sh share of challenges in this world and I'm beyond impressed of how you find the path to peace. You might be my baby sister, but you've had such a beautiful impact in my life and you taught me so much in life and none of it was being patient. You were like so comfortable. You and Keegan were perfect together. It was a pleasure to be with them see how comfortable you guys are. We welcome you to the family. Thank you for being a great man to my daughter. Your promise to her to spend the rest of your life together. Please resume our duties to take care of her. <laughs> 